Following on from our original solenoid opening and closing tools for the 5 and 6 speed ASINs and then the small canister version for the 6 speeds we've now developed a tool to cover the Toyota Lexus range which has transmissions U660, A750, A761 etc. These transmissions or valve bodies have two types of solenoid, SL solenoid and this toolkit has been designed to cover both types of solenoid. The larger version the larger version is very similar to what we're used to seeing with the with the earlier kits so I'll focus our attention on the smaller version which has some subtle differences. The holding fixture is now covers both types but the the way we open and close is, is fundamentally the same as the previous kits. So we start with spacer 1A in holding fixture number 1. Insert the small solenoid using the smaller opening tool. We peel back the solenoid as before, peel back the canister. rotating in both directions I'll put that down to come back to later using the drift we knock the solenoid out of the fixture and then take the solenoid apart At this point we change from spacer A, 1A to 1B. This is to straighten the canister. Insert the straightening tool. Push down into the fixture. Turn it round, press down again to ensure it's perfectly true before we move on change back to space of 1A assembling the internals we align the flat like so insert it into the canister We now insert the assembled solenoid into the fixture, ensuring that everything is pressed home. We then focus our attention on the turret and the valve. This is exactly the same as the previous, but the, diff the main difference is we have a cutout that we must align the larger of the two notches on the turret. So we insert and align the large notch. Then the two are brought together and align the front two cutouts. Then we are ready to press and roll the canister back together. One completed solenoid. Noticing the notch that hasn't been rolled over. Bringing it back as normal. Now moving on to the larger of the two solenoids. Just turn the fixture over and we concentrate on number two. Again start with number two A. Insert the solenoid and using the other opening tool just like the original style rotate, rotate it round and 
place the turret for cleaning, etc. Remove the solenoid. Take it apart. As you can see, it's just the same design as the 5550s and the 6 speed. Okay, so we need to straighten the canister. Move to spacer 2B. Insert the canister and the straightening fixture. So the straightening tool. Knock it out. Turn it round a bit. And make sure everything is perfectly straight. At this point, I always change back to spacer 2A. So 2A. Assemble. Press everything home. Make sure it's good. Again, take them take the turret and the valve out to clean as before. We align the knot as before with the center of the connector. So we can make no mistakes there. And then use the number two side of the closing tool. We press it home. Get the solenoid out. Job complete. Couldn't be easier.